this video I'm going to talk about Facebook social plugins and how to add them to your website. So what a social plugin is, it's, it's an additional button to be added onto your web page and you can simply add them in. Uh, I'm going to talk about the like button and uh, this is the way to create the code to place on your website. So the like button lets you share pages from your site back to Facebook with a simple click and that would be the like button that's here. So first you would enter in the URL that you want to share and then you would select the the button that you want to use. So I'm just going to enter in and you can also have the option here to add the send button you, or you could keep it or you could remove it in and there's also an option here for the different types of layouts so you can have the button count where it counts the number of likes on your page and it can also have a box count so it will format it more in a, a vertical style or you could just do the standard one uh, you can set the width so this is a way to customize the width that you will be using on your particular site so depending on how much space you have to work with uh, you could set the, the different dimensions of the like. Uh, there's also another way to use the like to hide it um, if you just want the like button by itself uh, so I'm, I'm going to go through that a little bit later on um, so if you simply want to have the like button uh, there, there's going to be another way to hide that with a div. Uh, you're able to select the different types of font that's going to be laid out on the button and you also have a choice of either dark or light so if your layout if you've got a dark layout on your website you want to check choose dark if you've got a light one you want to choose light and then once you're ready once you've created uh, entered in your URL and set the style that you want to create the code in you would just simply select get code and what this is going to do this is going to pop up the HTML5 code the iframe code or the uh, URL code. So by, by standard what you want to use is you want to use the HTML5 code. So this is what you would put right under the body of your HTML code as soon as the page loads. It has to load the fb slash root div and it loads the JavaScript SDK into that div. So this is essential in order to place on your site and then this code here below this is where, where you would put uh, depending on where you want the like button to show up and if you wanted to hide this particular code you could simply uh, create another div around it and style it to the width that you want to use and hide the um, the overflow so you just put a style of overflow hidden uh, set a width of the width that you want to use at the height that you want to use and that would be the way to hide the rest of the button text if you if you just simply wanted to have the simple like button within your website and this is the way to add a like button to your web page uh, using the Facebook social plugins thanks a lot for watching just want to uh, mention that I do have a really good upcoming video coming up for YouTube tips I'm doing a strategy where I'm trying to grow to 1 million views and I'm going to be posting on a regular basis what I learn each month and what I'm finding is working and what's not working. So please be sure to subscribe to get that latest information as it's coming out. Thanks again.